Good evening, gen gentlemen and ladies, ladies and gentlemen alike. How you, how you stoners doing today? I hope all is well. Sorry, I wasn't able to stream yesterday. Uh, business got in the way, and uh, y'all know how that is. You know, personal life kind of has to come, come, has to come first sometimes. But uh, we're back today playing some Persona Five. Uh, my damn. Uh, Streamlabs doesn't want to work for me. Something's going on here. One second, guys. I apologize. I think it's because uh, my computer might think we're still uh, multi multi screening this. Shoot, it does. I think it does think that. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. That's that. It's not going to be a problem. <laughs> Oh well, but uh, either way, thank you guys for joining me. I appreciate that. I just gotta, I just gotta get something else uh, up real quick. That way, I can monitor if anybody uh, does any donations or follows or you know any of that good stuff. You know all of that good stuff that might happen, might not. You know, sh you know, shit happens. We'll see. But uh, let's see. Uh, we got we got Adiel and Azriel in the chat. What's up, guys? Thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate that. Azriel says, "What's up, big boy? What's up, Azriel?" And Adiel says, "All right, let's do this." And says hello to me and Azriel. What's up, Adiel? I appreciate you guys jumping in. So today we do have a hamper box as well that I want to unbox for you guys. Um, l let me just make sure everything's up and running. Let's turn down that uh persona music a little bit that way y'all can hear me and i can hear myself better turn it up in my or turn it down in my headphones or else that's not going to do anything for me <laughs> okay so we got our chat up we got our we got our um stream labs okay nice and um i also changed up uh i also changed the way that the donation thing comes up for the night the night bot as well so that should be a little bit different as well today, but um, okay. So, uh, before we start this hamper unboxing, let's uh, let's take a toke from the venom from the venom bong. Today we're smoking a whole, a whole uh, variety of marijuanas today. <clears throat> so I, I have all my pipes packed with a different strain, basically. Um, so in the right now in the Venom Bong, we have some uh, some sour diesel. Got me some sour diesel today. Definitely some good stuff. Really uh, tasty. I I enjoyed it. Come on, come on. There we go. Sour diesel, 28% THC very tasty not too bad that's the first I've smoked of it today not bad at all and then in the Mista Twista we got some super sour lemon and just a warning beforehand I did I did open up the hamper box and go through it because there's a different way that I want to start doing these things um, so and then in the pipe that the hamper box uh, sent me I put a mix of the sour diesel and the super lemon and then we have some grape ape as well Mixed in uh, with with that. So yeah some good stuff. We got all kinds of good good uh, Good greens today very good stuff. I'm really liking that grape ape man I keep going back and buying more cuz oh it's, it's it's doing it's doing wonders putting me to sleep and helping me uh, Relax and you know stuff like that being able to just be out like a light as soon as I lay down. That grape ape is amazing, guys. If you have a problem, if you have problems sleeping and you live in a spot where it's legal to smoke marijuana, get you some grape ape. You will be put out like a goddamn light. I'll tell you that much right now. Okay, so let's get into uh, let's get into this hemper unboxing. Um, so uh, the first thing that I'm gonna pull out here are some uh, hamper tech. Uh, pipe cleaners these are really nice I actually used uh, used some on my uh, on my venom bong here on the stem here if you notice on the last on the last uh, stream that stem was dirty as fuck I just cleaned that right before the stream today so uh, as a as a little experiment um, so here's I didn't I didn't clean the Mr. Twista because I want to do an experiment I want to see how good these pipe cleaners actually clean it so look how badly dirty this is right now how 
how much gunk is in there. Uh, I'm going to try to clean it either tonight or tomorrow and we'll see how much better these pipe cleaners have done than, you know, my ulterior methods. But yeah, some good stuff. And not only did they send the pipe cleaners, they actually sell they actually sent a freaking pipe cleaner solution and stuff. It's called Kryptonite. So uh, from from what I'm pretty sure what I'm pretty sure it does is just makes it easy to get all that uh, gunk out, all of that uh, um, all of that resin and stuff, you know, really good for your your glass, your tools, you know, whatever, whatever. It's really good stuff, really good stuff. <laughs> Adios asked, uh, is it still considered un an unboxing if you open it beforehand? That's a good question. That's a good question. I'm not sure. <laughs> but um, I was thinking it'd be a lot easier if I just like had this stuff laid out in a, in a certain way instead of me having to, you know, fumble with it awkwardly on camera and stuff, you know? I feel like... I feel like this is going a little bit better so far. <laughs> okay, so and then um, as usual, we get some uh, some rolling papers, some cones, you know, with with all these hamper boxes. I can't tell you how many papers I have now. One of these ultimate cones. We're gonna have to smoke one of these big ass ultimate cones on stream one of these days. One of these days, we'll do like a straight up Q and A where I'm not playing any games, or we could have like uh. Oh, maybe during a Jack's Box games we could we could smoke this because that that doesn't require too much input from me, but uh, it it give me enough space to be able to smoke and play with you guys, you know. So yeah, that that sounds like a plan. Next time we do some Jack Box games, we're gonna be smoking one of those big ass uh, the super cones, the this one right here, the fucking the original, whatever. <laughs> Oh yeah, this thing's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be crazy when we go for that. And you know what? They keep sending me some hemp wick as well. Very, very nice. I, I keep using it. I keep loving it and I keep wanting more. You know, I keep needing more and they keep sending it. So it's it's amazing. It's very good. I've been loving it. I've been loving it. Um, let's see, we got us another another lighter. I love the lighters that they send too. They send some really good lighters. This one says it's lit. That's pretty cool. Not bad. The last lighter they sent was a torch lighter. This one's just your average, regular, run-of-the-mill, you know, cigarette lighter, bowl lighter, whatever. Not, not for your, not for your concentrates. And then, um, oh, oh yes, yes. The the one thing that I really liked that I saw in here, um, this this thing right here, this thing right here. Here, let me take it out of this capsule because you can't really see it with the camera. There's like a glare from my light. So. In some of in some of my local dispensaries, they sell joints. Uh, the joints are called caviar. So what they sell them as is uh, they put regular flour in them, they put concentrate in them, and some hash as well. And then they put one of these glass tips at the end. This is a glass tip. So you you roll your joint and then you put your your the end of the, your joint with the crutch in right here or no without you could do it without the crutch because this is basically going to be your crutch. So uh, yeah, you just put your joint in there, and then you're just you, it's it's like your little joint holder too. You know, you you puff on it just like that, makes it so that you don't burn your lips when it gets down to the down to the, to the last hits. You know, fucking love these things. Whenever I would go buy those joints from my dispensaries, I would always save the glass end. But now I have my own uh, hemper one, so that's pretty cool. I like that. I don't I don't smoke joints often, but when I do, I like to make it classy. <laughs> Adios says this is like Christmas. Oh, yeah, <laughs> some hemp mist right here. And then uh, last but not least uh, We have our well not last but close to last we have our hemper stickers that they send I like these hemper stickers. I like putting up putting them up on my uh, on my uh, TV stand I have all kinds of them over there. I I can't really exactly show you guys right now, but it, it trust me it's full of stickers on both sides and then I do it on my on my drawers in my in my room too I put stickers all over the place I, I really like this American flag one that's like all kinds of burning joints and stuff that's that's really cool that's awesome <laughs> man hemper does hook it up with some pretty cool stickers sometimes usually all they say is hemper on them but uh that American flag one is really cool I really do like that one Probably gonna keep the hemp wick out probably the lighter as well just for now because that's what we'll need essentially Oh, 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 and then the piece de resistance the 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 pipe or bong I should say that they sent uh, this month so this one Pretty simple your average bong, you know, it's uh got your 
average size. Well, not average. It's a little bit smaller than average size. It's got your two bull thing. Um, it's all right. It's, it's not the best bong I've ever seen. I, I've definitely seen better. And for some reason, it's got these little notches here. I, I don't know if that was accidental during the, the heating process or what, but uh, water leaks out of them. So I'm, I'm pretty sure that's not supposed to be there. But it's okay. It's still it's still smokable, you know. You, uh, as long as I don't tip it over, water don't leak, and you know you don't you don't need that much water in there. So it, I kind of wonder if it was on purpose or not. Like it, it makes me wonder because there's three in there, like perfectly spaced out, but one of them has a hole in it that uh, leaks a little bit of air and a little bit of water. But you know, like I said, it's not not a big deal. You could definitely still smoke out of it. Uh, it's your average bong, you know, the last two were definitely a little bit nicer, but that's not bad. Not bad. <laughs> Adio says, oh yes, hemp miss, how could I forget? <laughs> oh, and I apologize, guys, if you could hear all of that, that work outside. Um, there's a lot of construction going on over here. They're, relo they're removing uh, tree limbs from my apartment complex and uh, they're doing all kinds of other random shit. Uh, it's really loud. I can hear it. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but I, I apologize. Um, Adiel says, doubt it's on purpose. Yeah, for the bong, right? I doubt it too, but uh, you know, like I said, it still works. I'm not I'm not upset with them everything else is pretty cool as well you know like uh, and then all the other bongs were pretty cool too you know like the master shake one uh, the other dab one they're all pretty similar but you know they're they're rigs you know they're new uh, they're new glass pieces I can't be mad at that especially all of this for uh, thirty dollars a month that's, that's not bad that's not horrible Man, I can't believe this. I thought this. I thought these construction worker dudes were gonna already be done and head out, but uh, looks like I was wrong. They're just beginning to start getting loud. Fuck. Um, but yeah, sorry about that, guys. Uh, if anything, let's take another hit. You know what? We'll we'll take a we'll take a hit out of the hamper the hamper bong real quick, so you guys can see that it still works pretty well, and uh, we'll get this show on the road. Yeah, not bad, not bad at all. Mm. And the mix of that weed gives it a really good taste. Mm. Mm. That was good. Mm. Very clean, you know, that's the first hit out of a brand new pipe. Always the best, always the best. The first hit out of a brand new pipe, always the best taste. Always, You always get the, the absolute taste of the marijuana, it's great. Uh, Adiel says, uh, the fact that they sent you a bong is impressive already. <laughs> right, that's very true, that's very true. The, the day and age we live in. Uh, Azrael said, you know what they say, every time a stoner does an unboxing, another angel gets baked as fuck. <laughs> ah, that's pretty good, I like that, that's awesome. Alright, so let's uh, throw it over onto the gameplay, throw this music, turn this music up a little bit, maybe it'll, uh, maybe it'll over, over, uh, overdo the freaking, uh, background construction music i apologize guys i actually was thinking whether i should uh not do the stream or to do the stream or not again but i was like no we already missed yesterday i looked outside it looked like they were about to take off and get cleaned up and stuff i was like fuck it let's let's do it let's stream where they're not gonna be a, bo a bother but fuck they are being loud okay so um, where are we? We were just at, we, we tried to charm Takimi, but that didn't work out. Uh, I think we still have, yeah, we have a couple more days until we, uh, have Okamaru, ch uh, change his heart and, uh, confess his, uh, his crimes. Okay. Okay. So we, we just gotta, we gotta focus on our confidants still. We gotta still level everybody up. Everybody, everybody in, uh, Persona 5 getting leveled up. Okay, looks like Yusuke is our number one, our number one uh, winner right now. Mm -hmm. uh, do we go to Yusuke? Is that who I want to go to? Yes, 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 it is. Let's do it. Why not? Adiel says music sounds good to me. Also, don't worry about the outside noise. Well, thank you, Adiel. I appreciate that. Definitely makes me feel. 
feel uh, better about those uh, those people outside doing doing their loud machinery. Okay, so we already have the flower job. So uh, earlier I was looking into this a little bit, and uh, there's this uh, request that we have called uh, calling card for justice of the cats. We need a part time at the Central Street convenience store. So we got to do that eventually so we could get another Mementos target. I'm thinking once the targets start rolling in, I'll do that as well. That way we have an extra target and, you know, it's, uh, it's, uh, everything is worth doing once, once, once we're there. So yeah, I've been learning. I've been learning, Adio. And it's all thanks to you, for sure. I would never have played this game this way if it wasn't for your help, you know. Like, you like you helped make this game what it is for me. Like, no joke. Like, this game has become, has quickly become the number one game in my fucking, in my world, you know. Like, I fucking love this shit. And it is, it is a big help to you. Because I probably wouldn't have kept streaming it. I probably wouldn't have cared so much about it if it wasn't for you. So, yeah, thank you so much. It's some good stuff. Oh, Stony, there you are. I have finished your desired duplication. Here is your card. Oh, nice. Yes, I forgot that he did that. Mm, we could have him do way. more before we hang out with him. I see. Uh, let's do some recovery. Oh, these are like actual moves. Okay, I didn't even realize that. Uh, allows you to learn the healing skill. Recon. Okay, huh. I did not realize that these did these things. This is, this is, uh, huh, okay. This is a whole nother understanding of what he does now. Okay, okay. Um, you know what, we, we should make him do something just, just since we're here, let's, uh, we don't have too many bless. So let's, let's go with the bless. That way we could actually, uh, yes. have more, more of those. Adiel says, I'm proud of you. <laughs> well, thank you. I appreciate that. And uh, Azrael says, I DM'd you on Twitter, bro. Just an idea you might want to think about. You might, might want to think about it down the road. Um, yeah, my phone is like on a different table. Hold on. I got to go through my, my computer. What you could do construct a small sound booth in the spa. In a spot in your place, you can hang up some plywood that has some non-styrofoam egg cartons on them. Oh yeah, definitely, definitely, Azrael. That would be a very good idea. I could definitely get into doing something like that. I mean, where where I'm streaming right now is basically something like that. You know, uh, it's a little corner in my in my uh, apartment. I could definitely put like those egg carton thing I could actually go down to guitar center down the street and get the actual foam if anything but uh, yeah we could definitely think of we could definitely talk about that more after the stream I, I could definitely I could definitely get that figured out I could even hang out hang up like a green blanket over here or something that way I could do like weird shit I don't know like you know weird uh, random effects I don't know it'd be it, it, it's it's something to think about. <laughs> I will spend the rest of today working on it. Come back tomorrow or beyond to retrieve it. Blah, blah, blah. I came to see you, buddy. Oh, you must blah, blah, blah. We say the same thing every time we talk because we're like robots. <laughs> right, let's hang out with him. I believe I will find what I'm looking for at the church. Let us head over there. Hmm. Aw oh, man, I could have swore I changed the Nightbot thing. What the hell? What the hell? Let me, let me look at that real quick. Nightbot, that should not have been like that. I, I could have swore I changed that. I, could, I changed it to say something different. Uh, let's see here. Default commands. No. Timers. It's probably timers. Uh, yeah. Well, what the fuck? Hmm, weird. It says it right in my, uh, in my internet, uh, in my internet bar spot, 
but for some reason it's not right here in the chat that's weird okay i don't know we'll figure it out our prior our prior theme love it proved to be quite useful for me indeed after our enlight enlight eh, after our enlightening session i once again attempted to paint however nothing i put on the canvas was to my satisfaction before the gods of art i am not but a lost sheep Adiel says, another idea is to put shells behind Stoney so he can show his big bong collection. <laughs> right? I was thinking about that too, putting some shelves, but put like the bongs and like action figures that I have and stuff like that. There's like shelves that I have in my room that I could probably repurpose for over here. But what I want to do is like put like shelves that hang from from the wall you know like it looks like they're like a part of the wall and then have the bongs on there like oh you know what there was one more thing one more thing from hemper that i didn't see that i didn't show you guys okay so you know every time i'm smoking i'm like I, i'm always very hesitant to put my bong down because my my table is glass so if i put the glass bong down on the glass table a little too quickly it might shatter something you know so i'm always very hesitant but with the what what Hemper had sent me in their box is one of these. It's it's kind of like a mouse pad but thicker, you know. So it's a it's a good spot to place your bongs down if you have a glass table or a table you you don't want to like smash your bong down on or whatever. Makes it so that it's just a lot a lot safer for for your glass pieces and you can you can do exactly that, you know. You can uh, put them on a shelf and show them or you know when you're using them it, I, it's definitely already coming in handy like straight up i'm i'm i feel much better at putting uh, I, I feel much better about putting my bong down whenever uh now that it's under that little little spongy thing fucking dope but yeah some uh some shelves with a bunch of those and then the bongs on top definitely definitely and then like every stream every pre-stream everybody could pick a bong and then i'll just load that and keep smoking it in the entire stream until like the next follower then the follower picks a bong and then i'll put the other bong back grab the other bong you know load that till the next follower or something like that i don't know it, it, it sounds like a, it sounds like a good idea is forming here <laughs> yeah Ariel says a bong pad then yeah basically it's definitely like something like that it's, it's make it makes it so it, it's a lot safer to put my bong down our theme today shall be anguish I shall paint the anguish Christ felt as he bore the sins of mankind hmm. Hmm, I have seen various sculptures and paintings on the matter but merely re replicating them will not do would any believers be willing to model and help me capture the true essence of anguish? Oh, I have a feeling I'm gonna have to model for him again. It seems not. Well then. Very well, Stony. You will have to be my model today. Uh, do you want me to strip? <laughs> uh, make me beautiful, buddy. <laughs> Azrael says, Yusuke, could you be emo any more emo if you tried? <laughs> I can only represent the reality of my base subject. Anything more would be asking too much. <laughs> wow. No. Uh, that was another kind of downer uh, answer there. <laughs> now then, let us begin. Show me a pose that will put the anguish of Christ on full display. <laughs> I was going to say, yeah, like the, cry like the cross. Wait, did we already do this part? I don't, I don't remember. I, I didn't restart after well I personally I did restart after Kawakami I did actually do another save file where Kawakami is my girlfriend but that's like as far as I got but this should be after that I'm pretty sure this should uh, this should still be after that I'm not sure it seems this is not working I would like to capture anguish yet you seem you remain calm and composed even the slightest wrinkle can change one's impression of things I shall not compromise even for this sketch no. Israel says no nah, this is new hmm right it, it probably is I'm pro I probably just like thinking of like other interactions with Yusuke now raise your hands higher more give me more anguish bring it to its upper limits like this <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> this position so this is the pat passion of the Christ 
forsaken by his disciples, abhor, abhorred as a criminal by the public, pierced with nails and hung on the cross. I understand now. This is the true anguish of the passion. It feels as though something is boiling up within me. Well, what are you children doing? <laughs> this is a little weird. Um. Hey, we got Jean in the chat. What's up, Jean? How you doing? Says, hiya. Hiya, hiya, how ya? Hiya, hiya, how ya doing? <laughs> how you doing, Jean? Thank you so much for joining us today. I appreciate that. Uh, we're we're gonna be attempting to seduce the pretty b the pretty blonde in this game today. On uh, on I forget her last name. It's in the it's in the it's in the title of the the stream though. <laughs> uh, it's gonna bug me if I don't look. Hold on. Let me let me let me double check. It's on Taka Taka something Taka Takamaki. On yeah, I was right. Takamaki. Nice, sweet. That was before I even got to the to the page, I swear. I promise. I actually got that on my own. <laughs> I, I'm proud of myself, All right? Don't don't judge me. <laughs> um, yep, Azrael got it right too. Takamaki. John says, not much. Finally uh, learned to entirely... Or finally learned the entirety of Some Might Say by Oasis on my guitar. Ooh, nice. Heck yeah, that's awesome. I love doing that. Love grabbing a guitar or what I'm really good at is uh, the piano. I'm really good at uh, picking up certain certain beats or certain, uh, you know, scores on rap songs that I like. And I can actually repeat them fairly easy. So yeah, I, that, that's awesome. I love spending my time like that. This is an art study. Art. That. I am attempting to paint anguish, so I decided to use the crucifixion of, the cru of Christ as a point of reference. So you're interested in the anguish of the crucifixion? Hmm. While it is true that Jesus' crucifixion on the cross is a, is a symbol of deep suffering, it also bears a much more positive message, one of resurrection, of forgiveness. Resurrection? Forgiveness? I'm not sure I understand. Those ideas are contradictory to my concept of anguish. It may be difficult to grasp what I am saying right now, but try to consider that the anguish one may feel today will someday bring forth new hope. Ah, and by the way, I suggest you contain your excitement while here. You may trouble the con con congregation. Sorry, that freaking loud noise kind of... <laughs> distracted me i'm sorry jean i'm having some construction done at my apartment complex and there are some very loud background noises so i apologize but yeah it's crazy jean says uh, surprisingly enough uh that's about the only instrument i can't play but not for lack of trying <laughs> the piano yeah the piano is something uh me and my, or my dad actually really uh, focused on teaching me for the longest time like he started teaching me like little Spanish melodies you know and then it just turned into like a personal thing where I started just uh, getting rap songs or you know making my own little melodies and stuff like that very good stuff, very good stuff. baby quit quit sniffing the pipes so those shocking depictions were actually meant to represent forgiveness, not pain. Hmm, hope from anguish. I'm not sure I understand. I must learn more about the hearts of men. Stony, do you think I will be able to capture the truth someday? Uh, I'm sure you will. That's got to be the right answer. Oh, two. Two out of three. So there was a better answer there, apparently. Very, 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 very odd. <laughs> uh. Indeed, if I do not have belief in my own abilities, I will never come to accomplish anything. Hmm. This is exceedingly strange, though spending time with you has helped me discover new aspects of myself. You are perhaps a mirror of sorts. I'm in your debt. If there is anything I can do in return, please let me know. I wish to repay your kindness. Jeebus, that stuff is very, very, very loud outside. It wasn't that loud earlier. They straight up, like, waited for the loud part for later in the day today he no bueno jean says it's all right it's out of your hands not not for you to apologize for well thank you i appreciate that but still uh, it's, it's definitely right. annoying but um you know i had to stream today i wanted to i wanted to hang out with you guys see all you guys and be able to bring y'all some entertainment if anything 
Hmm. I hate how busy I, I am lately because I'm not able to stream as much and it really sucks because this is like really the highlight of my days m most times you know it really makes me excited and like pumped up to, to do this and just be able to interact with y'all it's the best <laughs> let us return home for today I bid you farewell <laughs> especially when you got such a great game like this like seriously <laughs> see you. goodbye Stony. Goodbye, Yusuke. We'll see you on the flip side, homie. Ah, you're back. Alright, Sohito. How are you, buddy? Are you still doing alright? You still making enough coffee? Alright, that's good. Um, okay, okay. Let's take a look at our messages real quick. Oh, it's, uh, oh yeah. Um, do we have any ingredients for curry? Let me make that Stephen Curry. Hey, there are some ingredients for some Stephen Curry. Nice. Let's ask Kawakami-san. Or no, Kawakami-senpai. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I love that. It's the best. <laughs> Sorry to keep you waiting. You just want me to make some curry, right? I wonder what, I wonder what she thinks that I keep just calling her over here to make curry for us. And that's all I ever call her for anymore. Now that we've maxed her up, it's just curry and massages 24-7. <laughs> oh yeah. So oh yeah is the only one around, huh? Oh yeah, Kawakami. But there's no reason to go to Kawakami. She's maxed out. So oh yeah, it is. Okay. Uh, Adiyao says Chihaya is priority right now. But Chihaya is not here, is she? I'll, I'll check for Chihaya. But I don't think she is. It didn't show her in that little option there. Shihaya, what's up? How you doing? So I read your fortune. I tried numerous times, but the Empress card. Last time I fell in trouble. Anyways, be careful. Uh, do a verification. I'm sorry. sorry, I'm planning for closing the shop today. Please come another time. Okay, no problem. Yeah, we're gonna have to go to Oya. Azrael says the fortune teller. Yes, yes. Shihaya is the fortune teller. And then uh, Adia says, so do whoever you can. Ooh, I intend to. <laughs> we pimping all over the world, baby. Hey. So you can't so you came. Phantom Thieves Believer. I wonder what's next now that the Medjed case is over. But how the heck would you know, right? Right. <laughs> I can't gather any news because of the chief. He doubts that I'm dating a younger guy. Hey, should we try going on an actual date? Any beaches around here or something? Just kidding. You have some Phantom Thieves info for me again today, right? I don't think my bond would. Oh, yeah, we'll deepen just yet. What are you gonna do? Yes, hang out with her. Hang out with her. Okay, I look forward to it. Jeebus, these people. Come on, finish already. You guys have been doing this all goddamn day. Oh, yeah, seems happy. I provided her with some info. Oh yeah, it's that simple info. Oh, that's right. I have something. Oh yeah, I might like. I should give it to her as a gift. Whoa, what do I have here? Uh, face beautifier, digital camera, and a robot vacuum. Uh, the camera maybe. She is. She is a. She is a journalist. At the current level of our relationship, giving this gift might be make things awkward. I should choose something else to give as a gift. Uh, face beautifier, maybe? At the current level, no. Okay. Robot vacuum? At the current level, okay. Nothing then. Don't give her shit. What the fuck are you thinking, Stony? You dumb fuck. <laughs> well then. <laughs> Why did it have why did it have me pull these options up if I couldn't do it? That didn't make any sense. Jean says, fun fact, Senpai has two definitions in Japanese. It can refer to an upper class man, such as Kawakami san, but it can also refer to a co-worker who has been there longer than you have. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, but Adia yeah, Adia says Kawakami is a teacher, so she is a sensei. But yeah, besides yeah, besides that um, like on on would be well no not on uh, it'd be Makoto Makoto and uh, and uh, Okamura's daughter Haru uh, uh, yeah on and Haru or not Haru Makoto and Haru would be the senpais they'd be the upperclassmen I believe that's crazy that's way crazy 
Uh, thank you for waiting. Here you go. Got us some more decent curry. That way, whenever we go into the metaverse, we're uh, locked and loaded, ready to go. Huh. I always thought Senpai was like, uh, like, uh, like your love or someone you're inspired by, you know, something like that. I always thought it was like, like only stalkers would use Senpai when, uh, referring to somebody. Like, you know, like, like all that, oh, Senpai, please notice me, you know, shit like that. Made it, makes it seem more of a stalkerish type thing, you know? <laughs> Jean says, but as before, sensei can also have two meanings. It applies to teachers, but it can also apply, or it can also be used for doctors. Oh, wow, that's crazy. I didn't know that. That's way crazy. As Azrael says, senpai equals senior, if I'm translating that right. Oh, wow, that's amazing. You guys are always teaching me new stuff. Jean says, however, if someone has a doctorate of some kind, uh, then the more appropriate honorific would be hakasi. The, the, that's pronounced Hakase. Ha Hakase. Okay. Huh. That's awesome. Ariel says, those are gifts you can only give to one of your girlfriends. Oh, okay. Okay. That makes a little bit more sense. Uh, let's look at our map real quick. See who's about to... Uh... Oh, shit. Let's look at our map. See who's going to level up. See who can be our priority. Makoto, but we're we don't Makoto, but we don't have that charm though. Takimi, Takimi is Takimi. She, uh, you know what? Let's let's go to Takimi. I I would like to see Takimi. I want to make sure I went to the right save because I don't know if I went to the one where I had put her, where I had redid the redid it and uh, made her. In an intimate relationship with me, or if this is the the <laughs> the save that we've been playing all along, we'll find out right here. John says, "Not at all, Stony. That's just a trope from a number of anime and manga." Oh, 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 the senpai thing. Okay, yeah, wow, huh? That's crazy. Yeah, I, I need to I need to do more more uh, research on my Japanese. Uh, my Japanese, uh, you know, culture. John says, Jesus, all this trumping, all this trumping my dog is doing is m making me wonder how I can breathe. <laughs> oh, hell no. <laughs> uh, the evenings have been getting cooler. It's easy. Let's see. Let's do a clinical trial. I wish I could study the data outside once in a while, like at a spacious park. Huh. This might actually be... I think I might have fucked up. Hang on with her. Maybe I should invite her. See, because this is the part where we turn her into our girlfriend. I could have swore. Right? <laughs> hmm, this place should work. I don't know. We'll find out. You may replay the date, Takimi. You didn't replay the date, Takimi, did you? Takimi. Yeah, no, yeah, I did replay it. I did replay it and got her to be in a romantic relationship, but I didn't get any further than that. Uh, but on the other one, we just skipped. Uh, we just went ahead with it, you know. I, I don't know. We're going to find out. The conditions here are perfect for gathering data outside the clinic. This should also help me see the reactions to more external variables, such as change in the environment. Well, then, shall we begin? Oh, okay, yeah, no, this is right. This is right. Uh... What's on today's menu? <laughs> nice. Well, aren't I lucky to have such a cooperative test subject? You really are helpful. Now then, strip and go for a swim in that lake. What? No way. Okay, yeah, because we're not we're not asking her to date us. This has nothing to do with like uh, being able to be with her. So yeah, I think this is this should be the proper game that we've been been playing the entire time. So this is also the furthest I've been too. So. Don't worry, I, I don't like know anything that's upcoming or anything like that. Uh, we're going to do. Oh, she's just kidding. We're going to do a controlled test. I want to record some data with that without you having taken any medicine. I need some comparison data, and today I'm going to gather every last bit of it. The more test data I have, the more helpful it'll be. This is important, so don't slack off. Then. Okay, now go for a run. About five kilometers should do. Not kidding this time. <laughs> 
Okay, and then we have this stuff. Um, robot vacuum at the current level. Nope. Okay, so nothing then. We should probably wait and just give it to uh, Kawakami. We should give something to Kawakami next time we hang out with her. Oh, well done. Thanks for your cooperation. John says, and before you ask, no, the use of Trump is not to do with politics. It's been around for donkey year, donkey's years. <laughs> oh, hell no, that's funny. And then John also says, bit of a raunchy lass, isn't it? <laughs> oh, that's funny. Adia says, don't replay anything. I don't think it's worth it. Okay, no worries, no worries. Hey, it's Akechi. What's up, Akechi? Good evening. How you doing, buddy? Good evening. I am intruding in your home once again. He's been here a lot lately. Why Why the hell is he always at, at LeBlanc? My apologies for spending so much time here. It's just so such a calming place for me. Well, I guess that explains it. Don't worry about it, buddy. Hang loose. Fucking peace and all that. <laughs> Thank you. Regardless, it's time I go on my way. Uh, one more thing, though. I heard a calling card has finally been sent. If the rumors of internal affairs at Okamura Foods are true, their president should surely be judged. However, it shouldn't be up to the government or police to, or it should be up to the government or police to do so. This is an unfortunate situation. I must I'll be going now. The coffee was delicious. A catchy, you strange son of a bitch. Oh, it's uh, Haru. No, not Haru. It's uh, Hifumi. Hifumi. Oh yeah, what's up? Hifumi is my uh, my shogi, my shogi playing homie. Hifumi, the shogi homie. <laughs> Any more of that curry? Nope. No uh, Stephen Curry today. That that means Kawakami is gonna be making some coffee. Sure she's either making us curry or she's making us coffee. I, I don't care which one, but it's gonna be one of them um, Let's look at our map Kawakami, of course Hawaii, that's the gun dude. Hawaii, Hawaii, Hawaii. See, I, I remember things by, by making connections Hifumi's gonna level up too. It's either Hawaii, Hawaii or Hifumi Hawaii would give us like better gun stuff. Hifumi would give us maybe better strategies, defense tactics. I don't know. Let's go with Hifumi. <laughs> Jean says, "Get yourself a haircut, Akechi." <laughs> uh, Adia says, "Even if you don't date Takimi, it's fine." Okay, yeah, no worries, no worries. I'm not like too worried up about it. Like I said, I did get it to happen, and I saw what she does for me. It's just better medicine and stuff. It, yeah, you, you're right. It's really not all that. Uh, all that, it's not really worth all that, um, all the, doing, like, all that oh. work to redo everything. I definitely understand. Hifumi's talking to a woman. She seems troubled again. Oh, I think our bond is gonna grow with her. Are you gonna talk to Hifumi? Yes, of course. Why not? Why would I spend all that money on a train to go come here to talk to her and not talk to her? Come on, Morgana, use your goddamn brain. <laughs> That's right, your next opponent will finally be a professional. My client's a big shot in the Pro Shogi Players Association, so I worked really hard to set it up. That's... But... Hmm, is this young man a fan of yours, Hifumi? No, mother. He's my Shogi friend. I told you about him, remember? Your Shogi friend? Hmm. Let me just say this. I hope you're not harboring any weird feelings for Hifumi. Ooh, I've been in that situation. Mother! As I'm sure you already aware, you are you are not allowed to date, young lady. You've started to attract a number of new male fans with all your photo spreads. Ooh, yes. photo spreads. <laughs> yes, mother. You can get 50 guys like him once you're famous. I need you to accomplish the things I was never able to do. Ooh, wow, that's a little, a little odd for a mother to say. Now, I'm going to work. Don't wait up for me. I understand. Eee, that is no bueno. Sorry. I apologize. That must have been quite a shock. Nope. I've had. I've actually had something like that happen to me in real life. Um. You're not allowed to date. Eee, come on, baby. You're all right. That's right. Uh, it's my mother's rule since the majority of shogi fans are men. 
My father is ill and uh, unable to work, so my mother supports us. My mother used to be a local TV announcer, but she had to quit to take care of my father. My father was a pro shogi player. He usually He's usually calm, but when he played, he could really feel his spirit. You could really feel his spirit. He never hesitated when making a move, just like a king. I really admire him, so I started playing shogi too. But after pouring everything he had into shogi, he suddenly collapsed one day. In my mother's eyes, Shogi stole both her dream and her husband, and yet she tells me to keep playing. She wants me to achieve her dreams. I should be working to help support us. I want to become a professional so that I can make enough money to ease my parents' burden. Um. I do photo shoots and interviews hoping they'll add some money to our household income, but it's honestly quite difficult for me. Um, you don't, you don't like the attention? Well, being in the public eye isn't bad in itself, it's just... <laughs> See, Adiel says, welcome baby, and Azriel says, welcome, welcome baby, or Bell, baby, yo, what's up, little dude? That's awesome, awesome, thank you guys. Jean says, that's actually a decent amount of, of, uh... Dosh and Dosh cash you got there, Stony. Two million yen equals fifteen fifteen thousand euro, about nineteen thousand dollars. Wow, that's crazy. I thought it was a lot more than that, but damn, <laughs> that's some good calculations there. I like that. That's awesome to know how much money I have in in like in in, in euros and American dollars. That, that's awesome. That's that's oh, that's crazy. No one sees me as a shogi player anymore. They no longer recognize my skills. I'm not playing shogi in the hopes of becoming an idol. I simply love my family and I want to support them through our troubles. <sighs> this isn't good. I shouldn't be focusing on such negative topics before a match. Well then, let's play today. I'm going to be throwing a lot of offensive moves at you. Wait, watch out baby, you're all right buddy. This will teach you to... This will teach you how to escape from uh, disadvantage disadvantageous situations that was a big word i like that <laughs> oh that's pounds not euros yep my bad i i always think the euros is the e but no that's yep you're right that's pounds my bad my bad uh osriel says the second amount is actually pretty fun yep, yep yep you guys are right i always i always think that uh that that it looks like an e you would think e would be for euro but euro it starts with a u right or i don't know i don't fucking remember but yeah that's crazy that's crazy but yes i gotta remember that that's pound the other one is euro i forget what the euro one looks like but i can remember that now pound is e <laughs> i feel like if fumi's cr uh, trust is crust trust is growing in me noise ranking he fool me up as well allows you to attempt the Attempt to escape even when surrounded by the enemy. Right. Nice, that's actually pretty good. That might come in handy. Hifumi taught you how to use Kakoi Ka Kakoi Kazushi. Are you ready? That aura, my right eye is switching now. It's time to unleash my hidden evil eye. I'll start. <laughs> no, to a fair match. Oh, hell no. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. So, no, I, I kind of... I get it. I get you now. Jean is, has, has put the, the euro symbol and the pound symbol, but okay. Huh. Okay, that that makes... Okay, that, that makes me uh, feel better because they are kind of similar. Especially for a dumb American that doesn't pay attention, you know. <laughs> But um, hell yeah, that's definitely that teaches that teaches something. That's good stuff. Man, that's so crazy. All right. Yen is just ah, oh, I I, if I ever went to Japan or something and tried to get time. around and pay my way, I'd be like, is that a lot? Like, am am I getting ripped off? Like, <laughs> like I I don't know, five hundred five hundred yen that for for a, I, I I don't know. <laughs> Phew, that wasn't so bad. Let's continue our lesson next time. John says, no worries, mate. That's why I'm here. Oh, yeah. Heck, yeah. I'm glad, too. Thank you very Hi. much. Thank you for waiting. Here you go. LeBlanc coffee. Coffee. All right. I'll see you later. Nice. Very, very good. Very good. 
Man, I love that fucking music. Uh, the other day I actually did uh, drive around in my truck playing the Persona soundtrack and stuff. Ooh, it was it was a good time. Huh, who could that be at this hour? Who could it be? That is a very good question. Oh, it's uh him. <laughs> Want to go to downtown? Uh, earlier I got some info that I can't turn a blind eye to. Ooh, we might just get some more uh, targets for mementos. I got us two passes. Want to go and check it out tomorrow? Dometown. Oh, Mishima, that's his name. God damn it. Why can I never remember that? Mishima. Dometown. <laughs> you want to go to Dometown? That sounds, that sounds very, very dirty. Especially in my hometown, because... Uh, if somebody said I'm going to Dome Town with somebody, it would imply that they were about to get oral sex. <laughs> uh, thanks, it's reassuring to have you with me. Uh. Oh shit, I didn't, I didn't mean to put guess. I have no choice. Oops, that was, that was a problem. That was, that, that wasn't a mistake. I didn't mean to do that. Wait, I, I committed though. He, he did that on his, he did that on his own. So I did the right, I did the, uh, what? Okay, I'm confused, I'm sorry. I'm already a little, I'm not high enough yet. I'm getting confused. We need to, we need to take another, we need to take another toke. Let's see, Jean says, uh, Japanese is actually, the Japanese uh, yen is actually pretty worthless. One Japanese yen is like 0.90, um. 0.90 US dollars. That's less than a penny. Oh wow, that's crazy. That's way crazy. Oh, what am I doing? I should be using my hemp, my hemp rope. That way we're not getting any of that butane in, in our lungs or anything. That's crazy though. Adiel says, the yen to dollars, you just subtract two zeros uh, to get an approximate. So 20,000 yen is like $20. Hmm, that's crazy. Okay, see, I, I kind of thought it was something like that. Like I was able to get a little bit of an idea, but once we got into the million yen, I thought I thought we were like pretty high in the in the dollars but like 16,000 or what was it 19,000 ain't as as high as I thought as as I thought it was he gets his opponents to bet money on and then cheats and to win it all oh stony what are you doing here uh taking a breather a breather that sounds so cool man that's so good perfect for a superhero superhero oh come on Mishima uh, you you bl you're blurting things out. That's no bueno. Uh, <laughs> Osriel says Nigerian currency is worse. I believe a friend of mine did the calculations. Seven hundred and fifty dollars equals two hundred and seven thousand three hundred and fifty-five Nigerian. Holy crap! That's crazy. Wow. <laughs> uh, yeah, we want to do something about that cheater who comes here. Cheater. Oh, maybe it was that guy I just beat. I handed his ass to him, and he ran home crying. I was rusty at first since it wasn't gun about, but it, it was easy once I got the hang of it. What, what? Really? But you're just a kid. So what? Age is irrelevant. <laughs> I love this kid. He's, he's, he's a good kid. So, uh, you know, I've seen your face somewhere before. Oh, oh are you Shinya Oda, the gaming prodigy? Don't address me without an honorific. Who are you anyway? You, you don't remember me? We fought one time in a tournament. It's me, Mishima. Machine Man. Machine Man. <laughs> I, I don't remember. I fought way too many people. You'd only stick in my memory if you did. If you were something special. <laughs> wow, you really are the king. The way you talk sounds so cool. Who is this guy? Your friend? Uh, more or less. <laughs> what, what is that supposed to mean? We are friends. Hey. <laughs> oh, that's fucked up. Stony, do you have any spare time? Want to go check out the theme park? There's no gun about here, and I'm getting annoyed with all the people watching me. Let's go. Let's do it. Yeah, what about Mashima? Hey, um. Uh, can he hold our bags? <laughs> can he join us? Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. Nice. That was three with each of them. That was dope. Never seen that before. Yeah, yeah. You could come along. 
<laughs> wow, so kind. I knew the king had a big heart. Nice. I'm glad everybody was able to mesh well and combine. I've, I've had multiple attempts at something like that in real life where I've tried to combine two people that don't know each other and it just didn't work out. But hey, that's life, you know. Shit happens. I've gone to like Six Flags with, uh, you know, a group of people I didn't know, basically like my sister and a bunch of her friends. I've had good times like that, you know, I've had bad times. It's it's a roll of the dice. It's a, definitely a roll of the dice. <laughs> for, for my for my life, at least. Uh, let's see what the TV's saying. Our next story is about Okamura Foods. Today, we take an in-depth look into Kanikazu Okamura, the man who made the chain what it is today. <clears throat> Mr. Okamura is well connected, blah blah blah, Haru's dad, okay, it's okay, we didn't miss much. Um, who's, who's messaging us? Baby, what, what is up with you, bud? Why do you want so much attention? Hey, we could go to Yoshida, or, uh, you, uh, Ariel uh, said that Yoshida was always first priority, right? I'm, I'm pretty sure. So, yeah. Let's let's go to Yoshida. Wait, before we do that, um, before we do that, let's have uh, Kawakami do something for us. Have her make some uh, some uh, curry if possible. Hey, there's some leftover curry ingredients. Oh yeah, get that yep. Stephen Curry out there. Make sure you close up. Jean says, as far as I know, there are really only three currencies that are worth more than the American dollar. The British pound, the euro, and the Kuwaiti dinar. Huh, that's crazy. The more you know. And Jean also says, fun fact, Haru is Japanese for spring. Oh, wow, that, that's actually beautiful. That's nice. That's crazy. I didn't know that. But that home stove, okay. Hi. Adios says, Yoshida. Yep, yep, that's where we're going to go. Azriel says, do I need anything that needs to be cleaned? I probably do. We'll have Kawakami do the, the cleaning next time. Because I'm sure we probably have a couple things since the last time we were in Mementos. Or maybe not. I think we might have had Kawakami clean everything, but I'm, I'm not too sure. We'll, we'll find out. We'll definitely find out. Thank you. The truth is, Dietman, Dietman Matsushita has been asking for me. Remember when he asked me to be his right-hand man last time? He's likely waiting for my response. Well then, please join me after the speech. Alright, no problem, Yoshida. I can do that, buddy. I can do that, homeboy. What's wrong? Hold on. I'm gonna take another hit real quick. I'm gonna use the hemp wick this time. Love this hemp wick. swear that makes it like a, a much tastier hit as well makes it t taste much cleaner I guess uh, what did you ask me here to discuss I heard you met with Kuromoto's grandson you have your ears to the ground huh and to think that he's the candidate the party is backing to ruin my chances of winning I'll be completely straight with you since I already asked you to be my right-hand man we're currently fighting the Kuromoto group what? You're fighting with Mr. Koromoto? I have ambitions of my own, you know. I owe him for all he did for me, but I don't want him to have influence me over me forever. All the more, now that he's secretly working with diet... I'm just gonna say diet, diet members from the other parties. I know he asked you to join his group, but I think you should decline his offer. Hmm. Hmm. They want to keep you on a leash, so you won't reveal any damaging information. The real culprit of the ex expense misappropriation case you were blamed for is old man Kuromoto. What in the world? What did you say? <laughs> I searched through the parties off the record accounts from 20 years ago, there's no doubt. Can you still forgive him? He led you into a political world and kicked you out in the worst way. But why? 
Seems he bought his popularity, and as a result, he was having some serious financial trouble. Love this music I as see. well. As sad as, as sad as it sounds, it's fucking amazing. Like, not as sad as it sounds for me to like it. I mean, like, the tone of this music is sad because it's a sad moment, you know, like, despair. But it's, a, it's good shit. It's good music. It sounds as if you're saying that this is my opportunity to clear my name. And so you need an answer from me or whether or not I'll be your right-hand man, yes? His own grandson has already tried to persuade you, therefore I can't wait any longer. If you join me, you can accuse Koromoto of his crime. You can clear your name and put no good Toro behind you. This is your best and last chance. Join with Matsushita and take my revenge against Mr. Koromoto, but drop out of the election. Uh, don't do it. Please don't do it. <laughs> I see. That's how you truly feel about this. Matsushita, I appreciate the offer, but I must refuse. You have no conceivable reason to refuse. My goal is to become a member of the Diet, not a right-hand man. I will not cast aside my beliefs. On that, I stand firm. This information would be the deciding factor in taking down Kuramoto. I'm sorry. Don't worry about it. I was simply offering you a deal. I assumed you might decline it. Very well. Please forget it. I apologize for bringing it up so suddenly. I'll talk to the party and provide support for your next speech about the Phantom Thieves. Hmm? Why are you doing this? I don't want a debate about the Phantom Thieves. I simply want to draw attention to them. And you can assert your innocence there on a grand stage. To be frank, I'll be happy as long as the Kuramoto group influence diminishes. Stony, don't speak a word of this to anyone for both our sakes. Very well then. Hmm. It feels like I'm caught in the crossfire of a political conspiracy. My friend is trying to take advantage of me, while my former mentor is trying to win me over. To achieve my dreams, I have to set aside my beliefs. What should I do? Stick to your beliefs, buddy. Yes. Oh, there was a better there was a better choice. I don't know what it was though. <laughs> hmm. Oh, hey, Azrael hits the the inhale command on Nightbot. So time to take a smoke break, pick a pipe, and let's get stony. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You know what? Let's uh let's take a hit out of the new the new hamper pipe the new hamper pipe we got today. I should say new hemp or bong. Oh, I didn't use my damn hemp wick again, son of a bitch. True freaking stoner over here, forgetting about the most, uh, forgetting about the thing I want to do most. Uh, you're right, betraying myself means betraying my supporters, which also means betraying you. For some reason, just talking with you always helps me make up my mind. It's as if my heart is being manipulated. Mm. Perhaps. If the Phantom Thieves truly do exist, then I'm sure they're very much like you. For some reason, you stood by me, no good Tora, who didn't have any supporters. Actually, I've been thinking about this for a while, actually. You must have experienced cruelty and injustice in this life. I can tell by the look in your eyes. That's why I sense your desire to help the weak. And the strength to stand up to the hecklers. To Matsushita, to Ma yeah, Matsushita and to Kor Koromoto's grandson. You're no ordinary high school student. Even I know that much. Hey. Would you care to talk about it? Uh... So what if you're right? <laughs> Just a joke. <laughs> I was like, uh oh. <laughs> Uh, Azrael says, I was going to say Gandalf. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I could take a hit out of the Gandalf. I don't mind. I didn't, I, I kind of didn't even give enough time for anybody to pick. I apologize. I just went for it. But yeah, we could definitely take a Gandalf hit. For sure. Uh, Jean says, uh, it's almost ironic that Yoshida wants to be part of the diet given 
how heavy set the geezer is. <laughs> oh, hell no. Uh, that's funny. <laughs> Alright, lighting up the hemp wick. The wicker hemp. Man, the Gandalf packs, packs a punch every time. <coughs> Ooh, damn. Oh, yeah. Ah, that's a good one right there, though. That packs a good punch. Fucking love that Gandalf. Hell, yeah. Good suggestion. Good suggestion, Nazriel. Bitty, bitty, bitty good. Okay. Haha, <laughs> sorry I crossed the line there. I've always lacked restraint in these situations. See what I did there? I relieved the tension by making fun of myself. Think of it as an advanced technique for winning people over. You know, that's, that seems actually like pretty accurate. That's crazy. I feel like my bond with Yoshida is growing deeper. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Every time we meet up with him, it does. Occasionally let you skip negotiation when attempting to obtain a persona. Nice. Mind control. That's dope. That is actually really helpful. You're right. <laughs> All right then. Well, I'll at least make good use of Matsushita's help in setting up my next speech. I feel like I'll be able to fully express my beliefs if you're there with me. I shall ask you again another time. I'll just let him say that last part. <laughs> I was able to help move Yoshida's heart. It feels like my charm has increased. Sweet. It even increased by three notes. Oh, we should have we should have had the fortune teller increase our charm. Uh all right. Every time I go to someone, okay, so here's the plan. I need to make Kawakami either do coffee, laundry, or curry. Then we gotta head up to the fortune teller and do one of these skills to uh, improve further, you I'll know. You but I need to remember what everybody gives me when I go to see them. So Yoshida just gave me charm. So every time I go to see Yoshida, Hi. we should go to the fortune teller and have her uh do the thing with the charm where we get more experience for it thank you for waiting here you go all right i'll see you later i mean i think that would be the easiest way to get all of our stats up like quickly or quicker maybe i don't know how could that be at this hour right futaba i found an awesome magazine I'll bring it to the hideout. You have tomorrow off for health and sports day, right? I'll definitely get your adrenaline pumping. I really want to read it, but I'll wait till tomorrow. See ya! I guess Futaba's coming here to show us a magazine tomorrow? Sounds like fun, but I'm going to bed. <laughs> Poor Morgana, taking a cat nap. Ariel says, both Yoshida and Oya gives you charm. Okay, nice. That's, that's very good to know. That is actually very good to know. Yoshida and Oya give you charm. See, like, knowing what everybody gives you beforehand is very, like, handy. Hey, Stoney, Futaba's down here in the shop. Uh, sounds like Futaba's here. Come on, let's go downstairs. You know, this is one of those chances where we're able to actually, uh, hang out with Futaba, even though, uh... Even though we don't have enough charm to really hang out with her, so I would say we should take advantage of this and actually just chill with Futaba instead of Shinya. Who's Shinya? Oh, that's that's uh, the king. Um, who's this? Yusuke on Ryuji. Yeah, I would say Futaba. We could we could go with the king next time. What would Futaba give me if I hang out with her? Probably knowledge right yo i'm gonna chill here today i even brought some pc mags oh i have enough for you by the way there's some seriously ingenious stuff in these things i may be able to improve my proficiency okay 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 hey, hey. so you want to just relax and read if we're not meeting up with the others fuck i can't i can't say i think i'll pass because i think that'll like make it so i can't do this with her right man See, it's very hard to predict this before beforehand. That sounds good. 
today's arena thon. <laughs> Spilled some of my soda. Didn't spill it on anything important. That's that's the, that's the important thing. Holy crap! This mouse is so big. <laughs> a two-handed mouse? It's so ridiculous. Oh fuck that! A two-handed mouse? That'd be that'd be stupid. And this keyboard is too curvy. How would the keystrokes even work? This is great. The self-built PC competition is really amazing. Have you ever built your own PC before, Stony? Um. Of course. Huh? Yeah, I knew I knew that would be the best choice. Really? Huh? You're more of a tech guy than I thought. You might even be a PC master. What were the specs? What CPU did you use? And how much RAM did you put in? Oh, did you overclock it? How'd you handle cooling? <laughs> we should go together to Akiba sometime, Stony. I read with Futaba while talking about computers. I feel the learning I feel that learning more about intricate PC components helped me gain a bit more proficiency. Nice. So Futaba points and proficiency points. Alright. Ooh, ooh, that increased to masterful. Nice. I don't know how that really helps in the long run, but that's nice. <laughs> Ariel says, you need kindness for Futaba and this will not give you anything. It might be worth for some social stats though. Oh, uh, well, we just got whatever uh, to master. I forget, I, I'm from being stoned, I already forgot what it was. Oof, I hunger, no wonder I'm in power save mode. I want curry. Uh, should I spend more some more time with Futaba? Uh, your kindness for Futaba. You need kindness for Futaba, and this will not give you anything. It might be worth for some social stats, though. Should I keep hanging out with her then? That's the question. That's the real question. I'm gonna take another bong hit real quick. It's a little confusing adding in the the hemp wick. <sighs> nice. Like I said, with the hemp wick, it seems to even taste a little bit better, so that's awesome. Ah, uh, fuck it, we'll do it. Why not? Why not? You mean it? Hurry, hurry. I can't wait any longer. Make her some more, more curry for, uh, for her tum-tum, I guess. <laughs> Smells good. When's the curry gonna be ready? We should probably stick to the, the plan, right? Make it how, uh, how Sohiro taught us. Futaba's looking forward to this. Maybe I should be adventurous. Do as Sohiro taught you. You almost done? Should I prep the rice? <laughs> Ooh, this. <laughs> that sounds good. Ah, uh, it looks good. That actually does. Ah, uh, I would, I would love to eat that right now. <laughs> so tasty. I knew what this is. I know what this is. Uh, it's the same curry Sohido makes. Oh yeah, decent hurry curry times two. Oh yeah, and then we're gonna get more from Kawakami, I think. Wait, no, we're not, because I didn't I didn't call Kawakami. When did your cooking skills level up? Incredible. They've been leveling up throughout the story. <laughs> we had a lively conversation about the complicated workings of a bowl of curry. Who doesn't talk about a bowl of curry? I'll say that was worth it. <laughs> Go for a burger next time you have free time. Okay, alright, no problem. Uh, see you tomorrow. That curry was super delicious. Noise. Well, I'm glad that was worth it at least. <laughs> the anonymous says so many comments. OMG, man, these guys are fucking up there. Sorry for messaging you all this early in the morning. 
It seems my father will be holding an urgent press- Oh, today's the day, press conference. Okay. I guess Okamura finally had his change of heart. That has to at least lift some of the burden on Haru's shoulders. For real? Congrats. When is that going to be? 8 p.m. tonight. I wonder if he'll talk about the mental shutdowns. Where should we watch it? Why don't we get together beforehand? Uh, sounds good. Ariel says, also, like I said, you don't need affinity points with Futaba, so spending the night was not worth it at all. <laughs> okay, my bad, I didn't realize. <laughs> uh, I don't really have a reason for meeting up, but it still might prove beneficial. Anyway, how does the Shujin Academy rooftop sound? I actually happen to have some business up there. Sounds good to me. It's been ages since I was last there. Wait, the school? Futaba, make sure you come in through the front entrance. See you all there after school. Oh? Hmm. Wait, where's Yusuke? If he's still asleep at this point, he's definitely going to be late for school. Yeah, what the fuck? What's up with Yusuke? Where, where the fuck's he at? He needs to hear this news. He's got to be a part of this. We don't accept stragglers into the uh, Phantom Thieves. Miss Usami, one week left until exams. You'll have no problems if you've been studying regu regularly this sem semester. I just remembered. That aside, Okamura Foods has been a hot topic lately. This much media coverage must be worth at least 10 million yen. Oh wow. So that would be 10 hundred or no no. Yeah, 10,000. Right? Or 100,000. Yeah, one hundred thousand. One hundred thousand dollars. At first, I even thought that all of this outcry was just some kind of elaborate marketing campaign. I guess it's given them too much of a bad image to be that, though. Advertising and public image are more important than anything else for a co cooperation. Or for a co corporation. A cooperation. <laughs> yeah. Are you familiar with a psychological test using these images? Uh, you show these two images to people and then ask them to name one Bauba, Bubba, and the other Kiki. Booba, Bauba, Stony, Stony Sun. You. Uh, I would say A is Kiki and B is Bauba. Uh, you know, I just gotta double check. Just gotta double check. So I, I was right. A. <laughs> yes. That's correct. You should have instinctively felt that A is Kiki. Sharp sounds like K and T are linked to a spiky image. According to one theory, sounds and shapes are processed in the same area of the brain. Furthermore, this sense is the same worldwide. No matter the language, the result is the same. Wow, that's, that's crazy. That's actually really fucking crazy. That's dope. That's, wow. <laughs> that's fucking amazing. Yeah. I like that. I like that this game teaches you that, that sort of shit. That's fucking dope. Uh, Stoney seemed kind of smart, doesn't he? Nice wow, call. you must be really smart to be able to answer a question like that. <laughs> fucking Morgana. Sitting in my desk just meowing away. All Everybody's right. like, is that a cat? I don't know. What the fuck? I hear a cat. A product's name impresses an... A product's... A product's name impresses an image on people before they even use or buy it. Big Bang Burger exemplifies this. The voiced cons conson consonants consonant consonants. The voiced consonants. <laughs> okay, now that I said it, that makes sense. The voiced consonants and short syllables leave a strong imprint. Although with the news these days, it may also evoke the image of the strong the strong oppressing the weak mm. even the teachers have their eyes on okamura well meow 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 he should <laughs> he should be having a change of heart so there should be nothing to worry about wow 
Azrael says, still surprised that there isn't that one student that is allergic to cats. Right? Yeah, somebody just sneezing away like, what the fuck? Does somebody have a cat in here? Like, what, what, what's going on? <laughs> like, the freaking student's just all pissed off. Like, like just really mad the entire time because he can't find the cat. But obviously, there's a cat somewhere. Man, I really want to find out why uh, the night bot didn't update for uh, for that uh, that timing thing. Let's see here. I'm just gonna disable it completely because I don't understand it. I don't understand right now. I'm gonna have to figure it out later. But besides that. Nightbot is pretty cool. <laughs> you want to meet up on the rooftop after school? Yeah? Rooftop? What is this about? Oh yeah, you weren't there. Can you come to our school rooftop after your classes today? I don't quite understand what is going on, but sure. Is Haru at school? I'm heading over now. Things were a little hectic this morning. I'll be there before classes end for the day. That reminds me, your flower bed is on the rooftop. Flower bed? That's right. The season is good, so I'm thinking of transplanting them sometime soon. Flowers are an excellent hobby. I will gladly assist you. We'll help too. Really? Thanks. Alright, I'll see all of you after school. Noise. Oh man, I'm excited for what's what like what's coming up in this fucking story like what's gonna happen what is he gonna say what is he gonna tell us at that fucking uh that change of heart that that press conference <laughs> you can just call me haru the seasons are changing soon so i thought it'd be nice for the plants to change as well here i'll, I'll turn this up as well so you guys can hear this a little bit better let me know if that's a little too loud this time it's a Yusuke Kitagawa production. All I did was add some... How do I put it? Aesthetic simplicity by balancing the color placement. Furthermore, Haru chose the flowers herself. It will surely be <coughs> a great bed no matter the arrangement. Hmm. I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> Why don't we plant you, Mona? Weren't you a shut-in until just recently? You'd better photosynthesize while you're here. Wow, that was kind of fucked up. Wow, meow. Meow. <laughs> Holy crap. Adia says, nobody is allergic to cats in Persona 5. <laughs> well, that's good shit. <laughs> that's uh, lucky for our protagonist. Well, let's get started. <sighs> Perhaps the <laughs> snapdragon should go two more millimeters to the left. Adriano <laughs> says, bad kitty. All right, with like a spray bottle squirting at him. <laughs> oh, that'd be That's so funny. That's not make a difference. Hey, you know how we're thinking of the school festival as our celebration party? Anyone else think we should have a real celebration on top of that? I must agree. It would be not only a celebration, but a welcoming as well. I'd like to do something among ourselves. Let's do it then. A joint party to celebrate and to welcome Haru. Man, I don't like this cuz they keep they keep joining people into their crew of friends that like have something to do with the phantom thieves like intruding in their lives in some way or another, you know? So Man, it's just so goddamn obvious. <laughs> oh, you don't have to do that. The school festival is more than enough. How is everyone else supposed to get excited if the star of the party's not into it? Well then, how about a night party at Destinyland? Destinyland? Is that supposed to be like Disneyland? <laughs> By Destinyland. Do you mean that kingdom of dreams? <laughs> the mouse is always watching. <laughs> it would be a bit late, but there are some plans that allow us to rent out the park for the night. 
There's a Disneyland in uh, in China, right? Or is it in Japan? I, I don't know where it's at, but there's one somewhere over there. There's one in Paris. There's one in like Japan somewhere, and then there's two in the United States. The entire park? <laughs> Adia says you're way paranoid. Relax. <laughs> you're talking about the Destiny Land, right? Didn't you say you'd like to do something amongst ourselves? I'll do my best, buddy. Azriel oh, says it's in China. Oh, okay. I did, but... Hold on, I'll go check. Wow, she's really gonna she reserve the really whole fucking like part. A celebrity. What the heck's she gonna check? Guys, it looks like it will work! We're really gonna have it at Destiny Land? Not wow. like one of the restaurants, but <laughs> that crazy. the entire park? Now that, that's suspicious as a motherfucker. Even just for one night, the price is insane! Oh, that won't be a problem. We had originally booked it for a company party, then had to call it off because of the scandal. We barely get anything back if we cancel the reservation, so why not take advantage of it? Oh, that's dope. Wouldn't that be oddly conspicuous, though? Right, that's what I'm saying. It's still officially under the company's <laughs> name. We needn't worry. Okay. In that case, let's do this. We'll just celebrate twice as hard today. If you, I'm if you sorry say. for disrupting everyone. You did come to help me after all. When in Rome. Well, Let's get back to it. <laughs> Fuck. So, uh, seriously, yeah, how much does it cost? <laughs> Fucking Ryuji, shut up. For real? <laughs> uh, it seems like we'll be having our celebration at, De at, at Disneyland tonight. Come on, let's be real. It's Disneyland. <laughs> it's gotta be. <laughs> hmm. That was delicious. Yeah, look at that castle. That's that's Disneyland. That, look at her hat. That's the Mad Hatter. Fucking look at look at all their hats. Uh, fuck. The food that's Disneyland. was arranged on my plate <laughs> as though it were paint on a canvas. The staff brought out this table and food just for us, huh? Wow. Now that's fucking kicking it like like a celebrity. I thought if we were going to dine together, it would be better to do it somewhere with the view. You fucks are crazy. The VIP life is incredible! Right. Luckily, they bagged Haru. <laughs> Not that I'd expect anything else from a private rental. There really is no one else here. Azriel says, dude, there is someone watching your stream that works for... That works for the mouse. He is like Oprah and has spies everywhere. Now pay extra attention. Oh, Adia says pay extra attention. But yeah, Azrael, there's probably a spy everywhere. I actually do have a little, uh, I, I do have something over my, uh, my computer's camera because I don't ever use it. So I'm like, if someone hacks into it, there's no point. I, I don't use it, so I might as well just block it. Fuck it. <laughs> so yeah, I, I am very paranoid. But Adiel says, no, pay extra attention. Okay, we gotta, we gotta watch here. We are the rulers of the kingdom of dreams. Is this lighting just for our sake as well? That's right. Wow. It's beautiful. Right, that's crazy. It's not as beautiful as you. <laughs> that's the kind of stuff couples say, <laughs> Shut right? Shut the fuck up, <laughs> Almost anyone would fall for that line in front of a site like this. Lady On, this view is not as beautiful as... Come on, you guys are getting way too excited about this stuff. <laughs> you say that like you're not tapping into your inner child too, Ryuji. Poor Morgana. This is just because Futaba kept nagging me to put him on. <laughs> Shut up, Ryuji. I did not. Eh, that's funny. You said something like that. Uh, don't fight in those. <laughs> uh -huh. Fighting brings you closer. That's a good way of putting it. I wonder if that has to do with where we are. <laughs> My, this is so heartwarming. 
fucking Yusuke. Honestly, I would have liked to see the parade as well. Oh hell no, a whole parade just for these guys. But given how sudden the request was, they couldn't get enough staff together to do it. That'd be fucking crazy. Perhaps that will have to wait until next time. Next time, shit. Either way, this party's totally the best one so far. It's freaking amazing! Dude, that would be fucking awesome. That'd be fucking crazy, being able to walk around the park by yourself, being like catered to. Oh, dude. Dude. That'd be an awesome fucking vacation right there. I'm glad to see you're enjoying it. Be careful, Haru. You've shown these guys what luxury means. Right? <laughs> This'll really raise the bar for our next celebration party. You're already talking about our next party? Don't you think that's somewhat premature? Still, how do I put this? I met Mona-chan. I got Mona to know you all. <laughs> Isn't everything going a little too perfectly? My favorite one is Mako-chan. Because <laughs> it's Makoto, but she, she, she calls her Mako-chan sometimes. It's actually a bit frightening. You worry too much. I must just be overly cautious because of my circumstances up till recently. I'm sorry for bringing it up. Hey, isn't it almost time? You know, for the press <laughs> conference? <laughs> oh, perfect timing! It's exactly how it is, too. Everybody pulls out their phone. Father. Ooh. What do we got? Oh, hey. Thank you all. The for Miss Nagy is now hosting us. Nice. Thank you. One second. I will thank you properly here in a second. Or actually, right now. Thank you, Miss Mindy, for uh, hosting us. That's some good stuff. Today, I'd like to elaborate upon the whole truth behind my company's labor situation. How my employees were forced to work under severe conditions. How my, lax we were with sanitation. My heart is pumping. I'm like so nervous for what, like, what, what's he going to say? What's he going to tell us? How my corporation How's acted gonna go? as a whole to cover up every facet of this scandal for all of this i wholeheartedly apologize so are you saying all of this was done under your orders yes i am solely responsible hmm. we heard that dozens of your employees were forced to resign due to mysterious illness Furthermore, these happen to be officials who stood against your proposal for overseas expansion. The same thing also happened to executives at competing companies who were looking to expand abroad. Is all of this true? Yes. Was it all coincidence? We'd like some answers. About that. I have a critical piece of information to announce here today. Here it comes. Okuma is going to say who's really behind the mental shutdowns. I... What the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? Dude, that's like how the principal died. Okumura-san? Right? Dude, what the fuck? What the fuck is that? What is that? What 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 the fuck just happened to him? Dude. Huh? What Father? the fuck? Why did he collapse? That didn't look right at all. Right. <laughs> Mona-chan, what's going on? No, that's impossible. Uh, we did everything the same. You're right. We followed all the same steps. We made sure we just took the treasure, too. I should call home. This, this isn't our fault. It's been okay all four times so far, ever since Kamoshida. What the fuck? If we let the shadow live, the real person won't undergo mental shutdown, right? We never, yeah, we never killed him in, in That's how it Mementos. Work. 
Dude. Yeah, it's gotta be. What the fuck? What's wrong? Th this is the same I remember now. It's just like what happened to my mom. Oh, no way. So this is the moment when mental shutdown occurs. Okay, so yeah, I was right. It, it is the same thing that happened to that to the principal too, right? I'm pretty sure. But why did they target Okumura-san? Damn it! What the hell's going on Dude, here? That doesn't look good. Um, I have to go. I'll talk to the staff before I leave. Feel free to take your time. Dude, that's not good. Haru! Oh damn. This ain't our fault, right? Oh I'd damn. I like think so. Some welcoming party, huh? That just like changed the entire vibe. Holy I'll get crap! I'll in contact with Haru later. Oh my god. But for today, I think we should all return home. Right. I stay on the DL. Don't make any sudden movements. Holy it's shit! It's been a while. What are you watching? Porn. <laughs> That's <laughs> it's porn. <laughs> Oh, this is never just mind. a hypothesis. It's not porn. I know what it is. <laughs> but perhaps Okumura was bitten by his lapdog. Are you implying that the Phantom Thieves triggered a sudden mental shutdown on Okumura? There might have been a falling out of sorts, so the Phantom Thieves abandoned a useless employer. Wow. They're really gonna blame the Phantom Thieves for that. And to cover their tracks, they dealt with Okumura. That's bullshit. Come on. I hate to bring this up, but. I'm actually here about that. Did you find any evidence? No. Actually, there's a chance that the party behind these aren't the Phantom Thieves, but someone else. Wow, wow, really? How do you mean? You were suspecting the Phantom Thieves as well. Right? Akechi's noticing that there's like a... Like, yeah, because we... The, the Phantom Thieves don't kill, come on. Come on. <laughs> it is still <laughs> hypothetical at this point. But I don't want to rule it out. We're searching the Okumura residence tomorrow. Same with Shujin and its principal. We will find evidence on this, no matter what it takes. No matter what it takes. By the way, I wanted to ask you something. Yes? You haven't looked at my laptop or taken files from it without my permission, have you? That's quite out of the blue. There were traces that someone transferred data from it. Oh, that was that was Makoto. There was only a small error pop up, uh -oh. but I noticed it immediately after I had that argument with you last month. And that's why you suspect me? Oh, please, give me a break. <laughs> Are you saying you didn't? As a detective myself, I honor the value of information as well as the effort invested in it. Nice. I take pride in what I do. <laughs> I thought you of all people would understand such values, Sai son. Uh, he's taking the high road on her. That's, that's hilarious. I apologize. But then, who stole my data? Yes, I who. Who? <sighs> I let my guard down. <laughs> They're mine. I'm the one who will catch them. Man, this this has just turned into a whole nother world. Well, that was disturbing. His face, holy shit. Did you see the news? Did you see? He collapsed during the interview. This is serious. That was gruesome. Wish they put some sort of warning on the video. They said President Okamura died. President, not present. <laughs> really? Whoa, you're right. I just saw a news report about it. Dude, this is crazy. Adios says, well, it's true that you didn't kill Okamura's shadow. I can't say the same about a certain black masked person. Wow, that's crazy. Man, this does not look good either. So, about Haru's dad, uh, the news said it was a cardiac arrest. There's a chance he'll pull through, right? I hate to say this, but usually after such a report, the only thing that follows is a com confirmation of death. No! Haru, why is this happening? Can someone die simply from having a mental shutdown? I don't know. I suppose it's possible that the shock could kill a person. 
Haru did, did mention how her father wasn't in the best of health. But for him just, uh, for him to just up and die, this has got to be some kind of joke. Haru. I'm sorry, but <laughs> Fudama just <laughs> popping in every so often. Haru. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> are we responsible for this death? This is serious, freaking uh, Futaba. What, what are you doing? But I thought it was supposed to be fine as long as we didn't kill their shadow. Ain't that what you said, Morgana? <sighs> it should have been okay. It should have been. He says it should have been okay. <laughs> yeah, there's no point in getting mad at Mona for this. I heard the same thing too, you know. In any case, let's compose ourselves for now. We need to act normally in public, but keep Haru in our minds. <sighs> Damn it, this doesn't make any sense. Why he suffered a mental shutdown is, is one thing, but what are we supposed to do from here on out? That is a good question, Morgan. Very good question. Hey, we got Gamer Pie Jess in the, in the chat. How you doing? Thank you so much for joining us. I appreciate that. Some good stuff. We're going through some crazy stuff here in uh, Persona 5 right now. We're just, uh, ah, uh, we're, we're, we're in the middle of finding out what's going on. Haru's going to be fine, right? Technically, I think, I think somebody died. We might, we, we're probably gonna get the blame for this. Oh, we're going to sleep. Sorry, didn't realize. I was gonna, I was gonna call for a massage, you know, but I guess that ain't happening. Is there anything else I could put up? Hmm. Nope, just the Raymond Bowl and the Choco Fountain. Not bad. Karen Pot just says, How is it going, guys? Uh, it's going pretty good. Not too bad. Just intense. <laughs> Some intense stuff. I'm like, a little confused I'm a little well I'm not confused I'm just like shocked at what's been going on here and very curious on how how this is gonna unfold but um, I think I'm gonna take another bong hit real quick I haven't taken one out of the mr. twister so we're gonna take one out of there all right one second guys getting my uh, my hemp wick ready. For anybody that didn't see uh, at the beginning of this video, um, we did a hemper unboxing. Um, I got this little bong out of it, that hemp wick that that I just uh, lit, uh, lighter, all kinds of stuff. You could definitely see it at the beginning. After I'm pretty sure after we finish the streams, you're able to go back and watch the beginning. I, I'm not too sure how how Twitch works yet, but it's possible. I've done it. <laughs> uh, let's go to sleep. Man, I'm like shaking from like what just happened and like like fearing what's like what's to be like oh man like so many thoughts are racing to my through my head like now Igor's gonna, gonna talk to feet. us what's Inmate, what's he gonna our say master has an important matter to discuss with you oh god what is Igor gonna well. say what is Igor gonna say first I'd like to congratulate you for expelling the one proud of their greed Thank you, thank you. I, I, I'd like to say I did it all by myself, but you know, I did. <laughs> or so I'd like to say, but something odd seems to have happened. And what? And what would that be, Igor? What happened? What happened, buddy? Who knows? Okay. However, okay. don't you sense it? The malicious will of another? Possibly. It seems a contingency has occurred. Has it though? At this rate, your rehabilitation cannot be completed, though I doubt that will be the case. At this rate, your rehabilitation cannot be completed, though I doubt that will be the case. Huh. I truly look forward to seeing how you overcome this predicament. Oh, I don't like words with dick in the middle of it. <laughs> I feel like my bond with Igor is growing deeper. Okay. 
sweet. Rank nine. Holy shit. We're almost all the way ranked with Igor. What does that mean? Prison master. All right. He's the fool. Full confidant. What does that mean? <laughs> Everything in this game means something, but I don't know what any of it means. We shall meet again. Okay. Time's up, inmate. Hurry up and return to your world. I think I'm gonna turn down the gameplay a little bit again. Let me know if that's too low or too whatever, you know, and I'll uh, I'll readjust it. Hey, we got S List plays in the chat. What's up, S List? Thank you so much for joining us, man. That's some good stuff. Uh, it says here in spirit, extra lurk mode. <laughs> no worries. Either way, thank you for uh, popping in and saying hi. Definitely some good stuff. Definitely, uh, definitely enjoy talking to you and enjoy uh, having you in the chat. Oh damn, that that fan site just went down quite a chunk. We were at like 90, 93, 94, and it went down to like 79. People are saying shit. Did you hear? Okamura died. It's all over the news. Oh, this is no bueno. Gamer Pod just says you will figure it out sooner than later. <laughs> That's quite true. That is quite true. Adia says Okamura's death is kind of sad because even if he was gonna go to jail he was gonna become a way better father for Haru as well oh man right yeah that is pretty fucked up that's that's really fucked up that that the other person would take him away like that whoever we saw in the metaverse besides us he collapsed during his press conference right I wish I'd been watching when it happened damn who would want to watch that I didn't want to watch that that was disturbing <laughs> you're pretty better off it was a total disaster I never imagined seeing a heart attack would be so unsettling the news said it would it was because of illness but either way you either way you spin it still bizarre <coughs> damn wish i'd seen it live that's crazy who says that serial killers man <laughs> listen this time, hey okay? it's kawakami my favorite teacher and in this age proletarian lit literature that is literature written by the working class did you see that interview i thought it was gonna be some hidden camera show at first i was so scared i changed the channel he really looked like he was in pain that was sick will you quiet down we're in class right now not to mention you have midterms starting on monday focus on studying oh damn we have midterms that's not that's no bueno <laughs> things are getting pretty bad man all this shit's happening they're, they're gonna have some midterms this is like this is gonna be hysteria. That is not good. Hmm, it seems police have shown up at our school. What? The police? What for? Your sister hasn't told you about the, any of this? Nothing at all. Could this be rel related to Okamura's death in some way? But there's no connection between our school and Okamura Foods. Think they came to talk to Haru? She's absent today. Then seriously, what they here for? What are they here for? I can't even begin to fathom a re the reason. Anyway, let's be particularly careful not to stand out and head straight home once school ends. Understand that, everyone? Man, we don't even get to do anything now. That's not good. Shit just like literally hit the fan. <sighs> we haven't found anything useful as evidence. Oh, turn back, turn the gameplay back up. I see. Uh, we're hoping to find something more than the calling card, too. We've confirmed the victim's connection to the Phantom Thieves, at least. Thank you for your cooperation. Speaking? Huh? They found a calling card in the principal's office, too. What? That's not right. We didn't we didn't fuck with the principal. There yes. there shouldn't be no calling card in the principal's office. I'm sorry to ask again, but your right? father hadn't said anything about the phantom thieves, correct? That's right. 
please contact me if something catches your attention. It doesn't matter how trivial it seems. You don't have to force yourself, though. Just anything that comes to mind. That's weird. Oh, man. My heart the is starting principal. racing again. No one told me about that. Oh, damn. I'm getting real nervous. <laughs> I'm gonna, this game is going to give me a heart attack. Like, no lie. I'm like freaking out on like what's what's going on here. Ah, and we already know the end so result. So your group didn't go after Okumura's life. No, no, we did not. And even the death of Shujin's principal, who we found a calling card for, was the work of another. Yes. <sighs> you don't sound like you're lying. Do I? If you wanted to deceive me, you could have easily woven up a much simpler lie than this metaverse. Exactly. Who the fuck who the fuck talks about a metaverse? They'd sound loony. Moreover, your account coincides with my own investigation. Is that even possible if it were made up? Mm, no. And I hate to admit, but with my line of work, I know a false testimony when I hear one. Right? Still, if you set your sights on Okumura based on my intel, it'd be before his name was even ranked. You could have ignored him and targeted some other famous person. Why would you go so far as to further investigate and pursue this criminal? It was personal. <laughs> uh... My teammate was in danger. <laughs> Simple enough. There's still no proof that another suspect exists. That said, it's safe enough to say that you aren't the murdering type. What do you mean there's no proof that, that nobody else exists? I feel like my bond with Sai is growing deeper. Nice, that's good. That's really good. She believes us, thing that means. She's the judge. All right. Prosecuta. The judgment with the confidant rank leveled up. But with bueno. the subsequent deaths of Okumura and Shujin's principal, the public's opinion changed. Indeed. Pressed to prove your innocence, your next objective was... Hmm? What's the matter? <sighs> Is it a side effect? What in the world did the police inject into you? Right? What the fuck? My vision is starting to get distorted. Hey, hey, can you hear me? Hear me? You need to stay focused. <sighs> Don't scare me like that. If what you're saying is true, you must tell your side of the story to the end. We'll both be in trouble if your testimony becomes unreliable. <sighs> well then, let's move on. At last we arrive at your most recent crime. Dude, this is intense. You know what I mean, don't you? I do This don't. calling card was delivered to your latest target. The one you had decided would prove your innocence. Who could that be? It was addressed to Sai Nijima. <laughs> myself. No fucking way. <laughs> now, explain everything to me. Oh, uh, hell no. We, we tried to take... Okay, okay. She's our next target, huh? Let's do this. Let's fucking do this. The summary of the story up to this point has been updated. Okay, that's cool. Wow. I did not expect to have... To, well, I mean, I guess eventually that, that... I guess that would make sense eventually, but... Man, that's crazy. Has anyone been able to contact Haru? Oh, wait, you know what? Let me turn this down again. Turn this down just a little bit. That way you can hear me a little better. Uh, there we go. Uh, has anyone been able to contact Haru? Um, I'm worried about her. No luck here. Me, me neither. She won't pick up. It doesn't look like she's seen any of our chats either. I'm worried about her. That's what I said. <laughs> Literally the same exact thing, just not the same. Uh, she just put more dots than I did. <laughs> God damn it, on. <coughs> On, you're gonna be mine. I'm pretty sure we're pretty close to. To, uh. Seduce On. I wanna, I wanna find out. Where is she? On? Seven! Oh man! We're far off. I, I thought we were way closer. I thought we were way closer. It's possible. Still possible. <laughs> we 
Because of me, Haru's wrapped up in this mess. I never imagined this is what would happen. Right? Hey. We don't know when we might get a call from Haru, so let's stay put for today. Okay, well, well what am I doing? Now, an update on the sudden death of Mr. Okamura last night. Today, the police investigated President Okamura's home and other places he visited. They're looking into whether this was a crime or accident, but what caused his death is still unknown. Sounds like the police even went to your school. What are they going to do? Oh, fucking hell. Guess I'm going to bed. We still don't know anything. Alright. President Okamura died. Is this just a coincidence? Is there an illness that could cause that? Wait, you know what? Before we continue on, let me grab another drink real quick. Man, today I was very uh, productive. I cleaned like my entire apartment. It was pretty nice. And then we started streaming, and man, this fucking this game, this game is crazy. The story, it's fucking amazing. Hadia says nobody expects Sai to be the next target, and I felt a little awkward after she told me. <laughs> That's crazy, right? Yeah, I didn't. Uh, I, I I don't know. I wasn't sure how that would end up, but you know, I mean, I guess it makes sense because she's the one interviewing us. She's involved in some way or another. I don't know. I just, I really I really want to see how this all just plays out. Like what what what's next? What the fuck is next? So it was murder. That's terrifying. This might be the biggest event of the century. <laughs> Audio I'll put the the command for drink on the night bot, but <laughs> I don't think I don't think I've customized that one. Adios says, "Wait, that's not a thing." I don't think I have that on there, but I'll, I'll add it. I'll definitely add it. Hold on, I'll do it right now, real quick. Or no, that might that might take a little too long. I might be able to do it. Uh, let's see here, commands, custom. You you would think uh, the default one would be like a a drink like to keep like hydrated and stuff, but no, it's not there. Yeah, I'll have to add that later, but that's a good one. That is definitely a good one to add, Audio. Definitely a good one to add. Stony, my apologies for messaging you so early in the morning. Things have calmed down a bit at home, so I thought there's something I need to tell you. Uh, what's the matter? Um, there's actually something that caught my attention. I think I need to discuss it with everyone, though. We should meet at the hideout after school. It looks like Haru is managing, somehow. Alright, let's meet up with everyone after school. Eee. Dude. The thing with the principal. Sai is our next target. Oh, our our fan site popularity is just going down and down. Anonymous says, okay, now I'm confused. I can't look away, lol. OMG, the comments. 68 and going down. Evil has perished. So, who done it? <laughs> was Okamura murdered? But that was a live broadcast, wasn't it? If it wasn't an illness, then it had to be murder. Didn't he kind of deserve to die anyway? Nah, nobody deserves to die. Still, I feel bad for him going out like that. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. That's pretty crazy. That that did seem very uh, like if you saw that in real life, if you saw something on the news like that. With this preparations are that. finally in place. Turn the game back up. The public has praised them as allies of justice. 
before they strike them back to the ground. Oh hell no. Now then, she'll be next. They planned all this shit out. They know that we're gonna be going after Sai. No way. How are they yes. just goading us I've like that? I've already spoken to human resources about it. It will be a heavy responsibility, but I'm certain it'd be an honor for her. How the fuck do they know our next step before we even make it? The culprits behind the mental shutdown cases she's been pursuing all this time. Ariel says, I knew that wasn't a thing, by the way. Haha. <laughs> I was just joking and maybe providing a good idea. Yeah, no, that's definitely a good idea. Definitely. I will uh, I will definitely implement that as soon as we're done here today. Uh, the culprit's behind. <laughs> Indeed. They'll become the criminals we've set them up to be. Wow. Just as you instructed. Dude, no way. They're pulling the strings like fucking big time. They're just bending us over and fucking us doggy style. Jeebus, this is no bueno. This is no bueno at all. It's so damn loud. Right, that did seem pretty loud. Hmm? Where's Haru? She's the one that called us, so she'll show up eventually. Well, even though things have calmed down, she must be occupied with what happened to her father. Wait, what? What's up? People are posting that we killed President Okumura. Uh-oh. That's no So boy, it's no. begun already. Yeah. What? Think about it. The CEO collapsed the way he did during an apology conference that our group caused. Gamer Pie Jess says getting it from both ends. What do you mean? <laughs> I missed something. <laughs> Still! They were raving about us so much, and now they just treat us like murderers? Right, everybody thought we were like heroes of like fucking like superheroes and shit. Like what the hell? What a lightning fast change of attitude. Right. They don't know a damn thing about our situation. What the fuck? Calm down. Not everyone is necessarily saying that. <laughs> you were playing just says that's how hard you're taking it. Oh, okay, I get you. <laughs> See, being a stoner, you, you, lo you lose what you say as soon as you say it. <laughs> but there's no way to vindicate ourselves. Oh, Haru. There's Haru. I'm sorry I'm late. Yeah, you are. I'm the one who asked you all to make time for me, too. <laughs> spring. <laughs> I was gonna say spring came late this year, but that'd be more of a sexual innuendo than a, a, a group meetup thing. I don't know. <laughs> My condolences. It must be rough. And in a time like this, probably not the best time to bring that up. <laughs> I'm okay now. Um, I called everyone together because there was something worrying me. Did you all target the principal? No. Not like seriously, no. Huh? The principal? <laughs> you- Oh shit. Yes. What makes you say that? Yesterday, a public prosecutor came to my home. Um, it was a woman named Mijima-san. I overheard her saying a calling card was found in the principal's office. <laughs> She's not the one who said it, it was the other person. Considering that this was right after what happened, it's got to be Shujin's. Well, no shit, Sherlock. It's the first I've heard of it! Right. Doesn't this all seem weird to you? A little bit. It may just be my imagination, but I feel as if... Things are escalating far too quickly after President Okumura's incident. I don't think that's imagination. What do you mean? Perhaps... We may have been set up by the real culprit. For real? That could be. Then we need to catch them as soon as possible. <laughs> Futaba, she all has her fingers crossed. That's pretty cool. I like, I like that they add that in. Hold a moment. Can we assume we've been set up, though? 
What else are we supposed to do then? Let's all calm down for a moment. From what Haru said, even the police are suspecting that the Phantom Thieves are murderers. It wouldn't be wise to carelessly make a move at the moment. We need to act as normal students for now. She's, she's got a point. In addition, we have midterms next week. Oh, that is not good. Exams? At a time like this? <sighs> I envy you, Futaba. <laughs> Futaba? Hmm? Got something on my mind. Gonna go home and look into it. What could that be? I wonder what that could be. <laughs> yeah, that's basically what I just said. Stone Stradamus strikes again. At any rate, we need to behave and not draw attention to ourselves. Them not drawing attention to themselves? That should be easy. I mean, all of them only have a connection to... Uh, past mental shutdowns and phantom thieves happenings and stuff like that everything should be fine don't tell me the phantom thieves did that to president Okum okamura uh they're heroes they wouldn't do that i'd be disappointed if they just turned out to be criminals Azrael says someone is gonna fuck this up. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> See, I lost something again. <laughs> it has to be some kind of trick. They would never do that. I can't think of any other explanation that has that has to be it. For real? They found a calling card with the principal, but that's impossible. Right. We didn't target the principal. This is ridiculous. Why are people doubting the Phantom Thieves over what happened to President Okamura? Israel says, call it a hunch. Someone is gonna someone in the group is gonna fuck this up somehow. Oh, okay, okay. I see like fuck up like uh like getting us caught and shit. Somehow, yeah, somehow they do get caught. Like, I mean, we're we're in, we're getting, <laughs> we're we're getting questioned by the police in a cell and stuff. So, but yeah, who and how? That's that's the real question. Very, very. Uh, it's still in the back of my mind. On the it's on the Bunsen burner, man. It's it's baking, you know. Those theories are baking there. <laughs> Arias says, before going to take the Big Bang Challenge, you should visit Chihaya to boost charm. Okay, we could do that. Uh, why are people doubting the Phantom Thieves? They'd never do such a thing. Isn't that right? Uh, doesn't, doesn't he know that we are the Phantom Thieves? I'm pretty sure, right? <laughs> yeah, I trust them. Anyway, it seems like everybody's forgotten all that they've done up to this point. That won't stop me though. I'll continue cheering them on. Make sure, excuse me, make sure you tell them that. Uh, well, see you later. Make sure you tell them that. Well, I'll see you. Right? Yeah, he should. He should know who we are, right? Mishima, Mishinama is a bit narrow-sighted, but he's a good person deep down. We can't betray him. Definitely not gonna. Okay, so. What can I do? Can I leave? I can't, right? Hey! No, let's go to sleep, son of a bitch. Why can't I get a massage? I am a grown man. I don't have to listen to you, Morgana. You're just a goddamn cat. Hey! God damn it. <laughs> no! They're seriously saying the Phantom Thieves killed Okamura? You have to be kidding me. <laughs> How <laughs> good they accuse us of that. Get it? Because Morgana's a cat. <laughs> yeah. With the sudden death of their CEO, Okamura Foods is scrambling to deal with the aftermath. Stock prices are low. It's almost certain Okamura Foods is pressured to restructure their management. The public is watching to see how they handle the issue. The issues Mr. Okamura addressed in his press conference. What's going to happen to Haru's company? I'm worried about that too. I guess let's sleep on it, because that's all you're going to let me do, Morgana. 
<laughs> so all we can do right now is sit tight and wait, right? Oh, he didn't even say right. Well, I could get a massage, but no. <laughs> God damn it. Azrael says, is it animal abuse if you pick a cat up and throw him across the room? He is a digital cat, so PETA shouldn't care. <laughs> like, like, you don't see him like how I see him. He can turn into a car. <laughs> It'd probably lock you up in a loony bin after that, though. <laughs> I'm, sh I'm sorry for worrying you, everyone. I won't be able to respond for a little while longer. You don't need to mind us. More importantly, are you doing all right? I'm okay. I'm more worried about the people at the company, to be honest. It seems everyone's having difficulty with not only clients, but the press as well. They're even handling the preparations for my father's funeral. I just feel so guilty that I'm unable to help out at all. You shouldn't. You shouldn't. You, everyone understands this is a trying time for you. Turn down the gameplay a little bit. That's a good instrumental right there, though. <laughs> just, just ah, good music. Good music. Fucking love it. <laughs> Audio says, "What would you do if baby tells you to go to sleep?" It would depend on how much weed I smoked that day. <laughs> you shouldn't. Everyone understands it's a trying time for you. And we're here if anything happens. I know. I'll get in touch once things settle down. Uh, don't push yourself. Thanks. Talk to you later. Bless that girl worrying about others even at a time like this. Right? She's a strong, uh, strong person. I bet they killed Okamura to make an example out of him. Impossible. Why else would they kill him during a press conference? I read somewhere that Okamura raised his daughter alone. Maybe he wasn't a great manager, but as a parent, I feel for him. Murdering someone to make a point is textbook terrorism. Like Shido and that Akechi kid say, the Phantom Thieves are a menace. Mm. E that's not good. That's, that is not good at all. We're straight up taking the blame for Okamura's death. Ah, oh, Anonymous says, please don't kill me. I'm not going to kill you, buddy. Police didn't expect much anyway. 60% now? Dude, it was like 90, like like five minutes ago. If you could rewind this stream just five minutes ago, it was literally at like 93 have we been cheering on murderers all this time? It has to be a setup. The Phantom Thieves aren't like that. They're not heroes. They're just criminals. I believe in the Phantom Thieves. They wouldn't do that. I'm really disappointed. <laughs> Baby, what are you doing? <laughs> You're just like climbing up here without me like... <laughs> without even like being having a place to like sit. He's just... What do you want, buddy? You want attention? You want everybody to... You want to say hi to everybody? There you go. Just just chill like that. Just chill like that and you'll be cool. We'll be all good here. Uh, I'm really disappointed. Were they just lying? No. Baby. Can you talk? Would you ever give me good advice? Do you know the ways of a human? Who on earth set us up? Does anyone have any idea? Of course not! If I were to guess, I would say the culprit behind the mental shutdowns. Wait, how do we even know we got set up to begin with? They found a calling card in Principal Kobayaki... Kobayoko... Principal... The Principal's office. <laughs> Someone else had to have planted that, obviously. In the worst case scenario, it's possible they know our identities. <laughs> Titties. Uh, this is bad, guys. Yes, our state of affairs is looking quite bleak. Uh, let's prove our innocence. How are we gonna do that, though? It looks like our only choice now is to find the true culprit. Although we don't have any leads. Damn it, why does this guy happen to us? I don't know, Ryuji, but I feel for you, buddy. I feel for you. I 
wish we could prove our innocence, but we can't afford to make a dumb a dumb mistake and get ourselves caught. We'll just have to keep laying low and wait. Let's not do anything uh, conspicuous, okay? Hey, sorry for bringing this up when things are so chaotic. I know it's been tough after what happened to President Okamura and all. But this is the perfect time for smaller changes, of, smaller changes of heart to restore your reputation. Anyway, here's the info I have. If true, this one is pretty crazy. Apparently, an ex-mercenary who works as an assassin is hiding out in Shibuya underground. He acts like a homeless person during the day, but then goes about his work at night. Oh, wow, an assassin, huh? He hasn't left any trace of his identity, <laughs> Titty, uh, though, uh, so there's nothing the police can do. Uh... Hey, everyone's got to work. Uh, sounds interesting. You really are brave. you damn right. Um, Adiel says, you can't go see Chihaya right now. Uh, so study at the diner or something. Okay, okay. We could definitely do that. You really are brave. Well, according to the rumors, his name is Yohi Kiritani. I'm seriously scared. I don't want anything to do with this. I'm leaving this to you. 420 blaze it. <laughs> <laughs> So laid back. Mishima really doesn't get some. Uh, Mishima really does get some amazing info for us sometimes. Our reputation may have taken a hit after Okamura's death, but we can still prove our, our justice in mementos. We should discuss this with everyone when we have time. Oh, and we we have to meet up with Haru before we can go in. <laughs> the killer who cleans up trash, eh? Okay, okay. So, we can't go to Chihaya right now, so study at the diner or something. Uh, diner, 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 diner. It's in Shibuya, right? Right? No. Mm -hmm. I forget where it's at. <laughs> Hadiya said Mishima just did the stoner call. <laughs> mm. <laughs> right. Uh, oh yeah, here it is. Oh, Azrael hit the inhale. Time to take a smoke break, pick a pipe, and let's get stony. Noise, yeah. Pick a pipe if you guys want to. Whichever pipe you guys would like me like to see me smoke out of. Could definitely do that as we take a little study break in the diner here. If I study here, I might be able to gain more knowledge. Nice. It might be empty since it's raining today. Let's go in. Wait. Do I need books? Because I don't think I have any books. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is no bueno. Oh. I don't think there's a smoke list, is there, Azrael? <laughs> I don't know. I forget. I forget what I put. Azrael says the grenade. Where is the grenade? Uh -oh. Hold on one second. damn habit of uh, turning off the light even though the light is already or trying to turn it on when it's already on then going to turn it off when it's already off but right now I turned it off when I needed it on but it was already on I don't know <laughs> yeah. Azrael says uh, it should be it could be a list of all available smoking devices yeah, yeah, definitely. That's what I'm thinking. We could definitely implement that as well. We could put a little list in there. I thought I did have something, but maybe, maybe not. But uh, yeah, I could definitely throw a, 
a good list in there for you guys to uh, pick from. We're gonna we're gonna put the grape ape into the grenade one. Oh, it still has water too. Nice. <laughs> I didn't think it did. Welcome, man. Take your order. Welcome to Good Burger, home of the Good Burger. May I take your order? <laughs> oh yeah, there it is. Yeah, I thought I thought I did. I thought I did. Azrael says, I believe Master Shake is a dab rig. Well, no, I can actually uh, interchange most of these uh, these. Uh, bowls onto each of the different uh pipes because uh all of the hemper ones are the same size the only one that's different sized is the is the big uh venom bong that's the only one that uh has a different sized uh female piece or the male piece <laughs> so uh like uh in 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 bong language uh the venom has as the big dick of all of them and then the hemper ones are they're not the smallest they're, they're of medium size <laughs> I've seen smaller <laughs> I recommend our new item the totem pole <laughs> the totem pole nice we actually came on a day where they had the totem pole I'm so happy <laughs> I had such I, I laughed at that so hard the other day uh, it was so funny so the venom one I actually have a bunch of dab uh, a, I have a bunch of different bowls and dab uh, pieces for that one as well because the, the other bong I used to have uh, the white one that had all the chambers and stuff the first bong I used to hit out of that one was the same size as this one so all of those uh all of those pieces are interchangeable if you're going to eat this while studying just make sure you not to topple it <laughs> that's awesome nice going that's some proficiency you got there eating that without mm. knocking it over nice sweet You know what? This water seems a little murky. I'm going to change it real quick. All right. Sorry guys, I forgot uh I forgot I didn't have everything like laid out like I usually do. I had to put stuff away cuz I was cleaning today and like added those mats to uh to my uh desk. I also have like a gun mat here or a mat that has a Beretta PX4 Storm it shows you like the components to it and like gives you the names of everything it's a pretty badass map but I'm using it to keep my pipes from breaking when I set them down as well definitely a good idea I can't believe I didn't think about that <laughs> audio says I'm glad my phone can easily easily handle to easily handle 1080p nice that's that's really good my uh, my note does pretty good as well. I need to. I really need to upgrade my phone though, really, really badly. Azriel says, uh, still kind of down. My first bong got broken. Ah, oh, no, man, that sucks. What happened? That's horrible. It looks like your studying went well too. Nice. Ooh. 
Nice, there we go. There we go. <laughs> All right. Oh yeah, more nice. knowledge. I think you were really able to study since it wasn't that busy, huh? Nice. Oh, even another note. That's pretty cool. All right. Wanna head back? Yo. I heard the Phantom Thieves killed someone. It's all over the news. <laughs> so you know you don't need, you don't know the half of it, buddy. Oh yeah, oh you know what? It's already 7:30. Holy shit, man! Time just flies when we're playing this fucking game. I swear. <laughs> Azrael says, not sure exactly. The stem for the bull shattered, and there is a four-inch fracture line on the body. Ah oh, man, that sucks. I'm sorry, dude. I was definitely a little upset to see the little notches in this bong, you know, but. Having a bong that just doesn't work at all is very, very horrible. It's, it's, very, it's definitely worse than what I got. Uh, Azrael says, in a weird way, uh, it was for the best because I know how to make them now. <laughs> well, heck yeah, you know, you, you win some, you lose some. But, um, yeah, like I said, it's 7.30. We've been playing for about, yep, two and a half, two and a half hours. Some good stuff, not bad. Usual time that we do. <laughs> Uh, but it's definitely been a fun time. This game is fucking crazy. This game is, like I said, is very easily become one of my top favorite games. Definitely, like, probably the top number one spot. Because this game is amazing. The story on it, everything. I, I fucking love it. I fucking love it. <laughs> uh. But uh, if anything, thank you guys so much for joining me today. Uh, do everything in my power to stream as well tomorrow, but... Man, things have been busy, and I really apologize, but, you know, life happens, and, uh, uh, but I'm gonna keep doing everything I can to continue streaming as much as I can, so, yeah, but, uh, we'll see you next time. Thank you guys for joining me today. I appreciate it. Peace out.